make you feel small, insecure, humiliated. Have we all felt that in sales? I have. Or it can, it can, it can empower you, it can fulfill you, it can empower, it can provide you with unimaginable financial security, confidence, and a constant euphoric feeling just to make you feel good about yourself. Sales is, as I always say, the million dollar skill. Uh, the reality is don't take vacations, live them. Making a sale is probably the second best feeling in the world. Maybe uh, I had to explain that to Felipe one day. He didn't quite get it, right? You understand it now, Felipe, don't you? Yeah, after three kids, I know. After three kids, he learns so fast. Okay, you got to be hungry. You've got to want it. Um, one of my kids had um, a, a soccer coach, and he used to always say, focus on the focus. And uh, I really didn't always understand what that meant. It meant focus on one thing intensely and do it right. That's why, that's why I'm always talking about sales, always. It is the one thing. We have so many distractions in this business, so many gurus, so much information, so many applications, so many different programs. But the one thing that will make you money is being super, this is your takeaway, be superb in your powers of persuasion. Learn how to ask questions with redirection, stroke, nurture, some of the things we just talked about the last couple of minutes. You become successful when you take full responsibility for yourself and your actions. What does that mean? Someone help me. What does that mean? It means you can't you blame, anybody. blame anybody else. Yeah, you can't blame anybody else. You can, you can shout at the politicians. God, God, are we all sick of politicians by now? I don't even want to listen to the news anymore. And I love the news. Um, yes. We can blame the weather. We can blame COVID even. Okay, this uh, <laughs> is there a plethora of excuses out there to fail? Don't yawn, Bill. It hurts my feelings. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we, we've got to take, it, it's when you accept, say, hey, I'm going to make this thing happen. Impatience is a virtue. Not patience, impatience. Why do I, that's a strong one. Stop being so darn patient. You know, like a lot of gurus say, Gary Vaynerchuk is one of them. He always says you got to be patient. I don't believe in that. I believe you got to take action. I think if you want to make money today, you better pick up the phone today. Be proactive. Take reasonable risks. Talk to strangers all day long. What's the worst that can happen? Hang up on you. Say no. Yeah. What do we do when they hang up on us? What does a gut salesperson do? Go to the next one. Or call them back. Call, call them, them back. back. Call them yeah. back. Hey, Jason, did we get disconnected or did I say something to upset you and ruin your day? What happened? Yeah, oh, I just, I don't know. I just, I, you know, I don't know what happened. I hung, hung up on you accidentally. Sorry oh, about let, that. Uh, it's okay. Listen, if I upset you, it's okay. I do it all the time. Let me send you a gift, okay, to make things right. But before I go, can I ask you what? Then you go back into it. That, you always go back. You, it's over when you say it's over. And what if you get a voicemail when that happens? Give me a beep. Beep. Nathan, Claude Diamond. Sorry it took me so long to get back. I got all the paperwork here and everything in front of me. Um, I, I need to know how to spell piles because I got the check. I got a check here too. Um, call me as soon as you get this. I want to get this to you. Uh, 421412, and buddy. I'll talk to you as soon as you get this. Bye. Bye bye. Okay. I've never spoken to you before. What you, when you get that message, are you going to be, what is going to go through your mind? Shoot, there's a check waiting for me. I need to call this cat back. Then call me back. Okay, first of all, what's, my, what's the objective of a voicemail that we don't do? We always leave these la di -da. Hi, just reaching out. I just wanted to ask you about the thing and that and everything. Here's my number. Have a nice day. Okay, you get, to, do they return those phone calls? They just delete the message immediately. If you halfway leave, through it, yeah, what happens if you leave a, a message? I've got paperwork. I spoke to the attorney. How do you make your name out on a check? Okay, what do, you get that message? You're gonna go, Who the hell is this? What? Let me listen to that again. I don't know who this is. I never heard a message like that before. What am I hoping you're going to do? The most important thing in a voicemail call back. Call, call me back. back, baby. What happens when you call me back? Do I have a shot? Yeah. Okay. So when you leave, so what, what, 
But what if you don't have a check for them? Then what do you do? What, you how don't do you have, do? Oh, go ahead. Call me up. Hello, Diamond Consulting Group. This is Claude. How may I help you? Yeah, hey, I got you, you let me a voicemail. So you got a check or something for me here. Oh, whoa. What a good day for you. Who is yeah. this? No, oh, this is, uh, you know, this is uh, George Smith here, you know. Oh, okay. It says Nathan Piles on your thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. I meant to say Nathan Piles. Yeah, George Smith is my alter ego. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, uh, and I'm sorry, sir. Help me out. Why are we talking? Well, so you said something about leaving a check. You got a check for me and you talked to the attorney. Oh, or... okay. Let me check. And this is Mr. Piles slash Schmidt yeah. and everything. Which do you, uh, is this about real estate? Uh, yeah, but I'm not, I, I, I guess I'm not I, sure. What I'm want. neither am I. I'm so confused. You don't have a house for sale. You're looking to get Yeah, yeah, sure do. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah. At, 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 have we negotiated a deal already? Is, or is this the first time we spoke? Oh, uh, no, I, I don't think we have. Uh, I've we had don't... a couple of people looking at it. Thanks. Oh, you want to do a deal today? I need a property. Oh, yeah, great. You really? Okay, off the role play. I see, I see what you're saying. I, it's, I get it's that. so it's so easy. We only yeah. make it difficult. Right. Play. You know. I'll apologize. I'm sorry. I made a maybe. I I got so many deals, so much paperwork, and everything. So many checks on my desk here. Right. I see. Yeah. How do we go to the bank today? What do we have to do? Back to the rule of five. What's the most important out of all those rules? Talk to five people or more a day. So if you're just going to leave voicemails, then you, what's the definition of insanity? We keep doing something and, and we get the same result. No return calls, right? So why don't we do something to get a return call? Every, every time. Um, be proactive. Take reasonable risks. Stop worrying. This is a big one for me. Stop worrying about what other people think about you. No one can make a judgment on you except you. How many people here are pretty self-conscious like I was? I am. Okay. Claude, I have a quick question. Sure. Who is this? 